Do you like a Kentucky Ballistics reference? Yeah. You got a spicy pillow, mites. Grant is handling this because I'm too scared that I'm going to probably blow something up. And it's ridiculously windy as well. Vindish is what you say in German. And also it's very snowy too, so I'm worried. Welcome to Enchanted Hills. What could go wrong opening this game up in the snow? Hmm, let's actually put some little bit of snow in there. That's a great idea. I'll pay 20 bucks if you lick it and hold your tongue there. <laughs> no! I'm almost up. Didn't like the backyard scientists do this and it like caught fire? Yep. Well, oh, if it catches fire on me, I'm dropping this. Oh, uh, we could stomp it out or something like that. No, don't stomp it. It'll just let your shoe on fire. I have leather on though. You'd be surprised how dangerous lithium is. I've actually heard that it can burn through metal. Ain't that supposed to be like magnesium? Oh, that smells funny. Oh, I can smell it. Hold on. I'm gonna get more fumes. Oh, oh, I'm familiar with that smell. I would say use the ground, but the ground's just a touch wet, so I might have to use this granola bar style. <laughs> you know, you know this is dangerous when I'm nervous about it. I ain't, and I'm like I'm holding it. <laughs> oh god. Oh, and I'm gonna go and cut this off. Oh dear. Oh dear. There's a good reason why I'm blowing out my friend's spicy eye. Got that. Wrap. Oh, there's the copper electrode. Oh, there she goes. And I see a little bit of copper there. Nice thing is, look how pure that is. It's super, super copper color, which means that this has not been exposed to the atmosphere just yet. In other words, it's still safe. Oh, we're in. Oh, I never thought I'd see the actual, like, lithium things. I was trying to do this carefully because I want the copper. The lithium is just a side project. Lithium is just a side quest? Oh, we exposed lithium. Uh, is that bad? Yeah, water touches it, it's gonna burn. Oh, this one, this is the copper electrode. That's copper. Put that on the ground, see what happens. Oh, there's lithium. Uh... I wanna try something. Oh. oh, yeah, that's lithium. Oh, God. Nothing? That's a bomb waiting to explode. <laughs> that's what's the ball. I want to, I, that's like a bad idea, but, uh, I want to try to attempt something. Oh, there's another copper electrode. I want to try to attempt it. <laughs> Wait, no. Lucas, you're going to kill us all. <laughs> Here, here's another lithium. There you go. It goes off. It'll burn your house down in the middle of the night and you have no one to blame. Except me. There you go. Here's another lithium strip. Oh, we need something to dry to put this on. Because I want to save the lithium for later. Oh, uh, you can put it on me. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> okay, buddy. <laughs> I think my hands are still cold. So they can't sweat right now. Oh yeah, we got a little plastic tape. This is mostly dry, just the bolt holes. Alright, let's try to get this thing all open up. What does it need to do? A tube cell light bulb, you see this one of the cells. It's not even that cold. Cool. How could you look at you expect? I'm also going to set the bomb on the table. I have a feeling that, that right, th this horrible science experiment right here is going to catch and it's not going to be fun. Do not try this at home unless you're me and Lucas. I don't care about our hands. <laughs> it's a little cold outside. It's not even that bad. Have you forgotten I only weigh 60 pounds? Oh yeah, I forgot. You're like 60 pounds, four, like four foot something. Actually, yeah, Like five, hit... five foot something, I came up again. Yeah, I just hit five foot on the dot. Yeah, you're like five foot, 60 pounds, and just small. Well, that's funny is the battery's been shocking me still. It's still shocking you? Yeah, it's been giving you the occasional shock from the copper electrode. Oh, let's see. Yeah, I touched the ground and I got a little zap there. Uh, 
reason why only the copper one is shocking you, not the lithium, is because the copper is the positive Conductive. electrode. Yeah, it's positive. The other electrode is a negative. To mean that we are safe. The sad part is both of them are dangerous because the copper will shock you, but the lithium will hurt you. I wonder what happens if I spit on it right now. Don't spit on it, you're gonna burn the table. <laughs> I'm just joking. Hey, easy. Are you Hawk Tua? No jokes like that are allowed on my channel, alright? Not come you just made that sound. It's like what most of us do. Just throw a loogie or two. Oh, you can smell the lithium. If only if YouTube had to smell anything, then maybe. Or just cut open a lithium battery. I don't know. Don't cut open lithium. Do not try this at home. It's a very stupid idea. That I've actually done die. this at home before. And I ran it through water because it ended up getting hot. <laughs> and it didn't even explode. That's what I call dumb ways to die. <laughs> I didn't even know it had lithium in it, but now looking at it, I'm like, oh, like this looks like very familiar. Maybe the next episode we'll do a video of me using my forge to melt the copper strips. I don't know, we can try to make Damascus. Now you're gonna get a jacket? Nah, it's fine. Alright. Uh, you know, I know this mine is shivering with his life right now. Yeah, I have an idea. Let's use the table to our advantage to make this faster. I'll go ahead and just hold this. To like pull it all out. I'm just gonna like probably like pull it all out. Oh, slowly. All right, now try to pull it down a bit so it holds this down. And pull all the lithium off. So you're not freezing your butt off. This lithium. Oh, it smells like lithium. It's actually not just the lithium, it's the battery acid. Really? Is that battery acid? Yeah, it's the... Ah. Yes, it's a battery acid making the smell. Uh. There's lots of copper there. Watch it, one of them is gonna just gonna go. Just what you're gonna see in the news a uh, kid burns down house using lithium ion battery. <laughs> I mean, it hasn't happened before. Oh, oh that was dear. Dangerous. Was that a lithium that fell on the ground? Oh, that was just copper. Was it? I can pick it up. Uh, yeah, this is a copper. I think we're screwed. About to be screwed. -ish. Yeah, I know which part of this project up because it's starting to rain a little bit. I think. I don't know. No, that's just the drainage. Oh. In my neighbor's house. I'm surprised how I'm not just catching fire. Yeah, me too. And look how long this is. I mean, you got like a whole entire like thing like right here, and it's like it's sitting out to like right here. Yeah, the funniest part is we stuck a piece of lithium uh, under some snow. It didn't catch fire, which I caught that. I, I got that on camera. Yeah, I'm I'm a little confused by that, which makes me think that this must be like some maybe aluminum alloy battery or something. It might not be a lithium ion, but I might check up on the specs because this is actually a battery for my RC car that died. And just stopped working. I'll be aware of that. There's like one little piece, like right there. -ish. This is a very dumb way to die. Uh, do I even have to say this? Like, don't try this at home. Uh, I'm probably gonna have to put like a little bit of a warning up before I post this. Ah! Oh, there goes the copper. Dang, you win. I'm gonna use this to hold the lithium down because that's the most explosive. Forget the copper. Oh, there it is, a nice little copper block. Oh, there goes the copper. There goes the copper. Oh, there's a lithium. That's a lithium. That's a lithium. <laughs> you have to be like an electronics expert just to know this. We're actually almost done with this cell. Copper. Thank gosh. Sorry. I feel sorry for the YouTube moderators watching this video. <laughs> There's no moderators, I think. 
So the ones on the top are the lithium, all the ones on the bottom are copper. Yeah, you can tell. Is you can tell on the. By just their color or something like that. Oh, there's another one. Another one went flying. This is how I'm gonna die. This is gonna explode in my face. I got these. Ah, uh, this is the last few. Hopefully we can uh, take apart the next one in the middle of the summer where it'll be warmer. My hands won't be freezing. Freezing. Uh, There's the last of that. the battery. It's like the first time I fully disassembled a, a lithium battery without it blowing up in my face. <laughs> Probably because this one has like died or something like that, but it's still. L look at how long this is. Just in one little lithium battery cell. This is so much stuff separating the copper and stuff. If you want to store lithium, store it in a metal bucket or in mineral oil if you have mineral oil. Mineral oil is uh, not made out of water and it is not conductive. And it's very good for thermals. Well, I got the copper and lithium. Do you get those snippers? Oh, yeah, this. that one just leaves out there because if it goes off, then it's going to go off. Goodbye. Yeah, no. Doing dumb experiments with, with, with your buddies.